Alright guys, welcome back, and I'm going to go to a produce stand, we're going to pick up some produce after I'm done working here, that's why I'm not in my little chef uniform here, so uh, we're going to go pick up some produce, and we're going to see what it looks like to pick up some from a nice produce stand. So, once we get there, I'll show you what it's like. Enjoy the rest of the video. I'm here looking at some produce at this stand. It's a great place. It's just a loco stand that we have here. And let's check it out. Oh. Anything you like here, they've got. It's amazing. And today we're gonna get some peppers. There's some yellow peppers here, some red. They're just sweet peppers. Or maybe a green one. Get ourselves a bag. All right, well, so we're gonna pick up a green pepper. Put it in the bag here. We also have eggplant here. Pick up the eggplant. Let's see these are all. Let's see. It's amazing. Pick up some corn. Two, three, four ears of this. You guys will see this in the video of me making something a little bit. You also have watermelons and cantaloupe. We're going to be grabbing the cantaloupe and I'll show you how to cut one of those up. I don't know if you can see this, but some of these are really green. You don't want those. You can smell them. They smell very fresh. They smell like candy. They smell really good. But I think it's the one I want to Got the produce in the trunk. Cantaloupe's going in the trunk. We're going to go home and cut that up. Show you how to do that real quick. All right, we'll see you there. So we brought home that cantaloupe, now we're going to cut it up. I'm going to show you how to cut it up, how I like to cut it up, and then just the easy way of cutting it up. So when you have a party, it's easy to cut up and fast and efficient. So here we go. Alright guys, and here's my cantaloupe. So we're going to take it and we're going to cut it directly in half. Literally, right in half. We have a nice sharp knife. I sharpened this already. So we have these seeds in here. we got to get rid of this. The easy and simple way of getting rid of it. i got to get a spoon here. All right. Grab a metal spoon. Metal spoon's the easiest way of doing it. So you take it, go in that way, kind of go in that way. You're cupping it in. So when you do it, you're kind of making a nice little circle in there. All right? And you should be able to take it out just like that. And look at that. All you have left is juice. And you have all the seeds out. That's perfect. Get it away. Can't really do anything with it, so we're just going it away. There's a few seeds left in here. Just clean it up a little. And that is it. Boom. And then I'm just gonna drain this out a little. You can drink this if you want. Save it, whatever you want to do with it. All right. Cut it in half. We're gonna cut it again in half. Now, at parties, you can serve it, or at parties or at home, you can serve it just like this, like a watermelon. All right, just like that. But if you want to cut it up, an easy way of cutting it, let's get this out of my way. Is like this. You take it, and you do little chunks down through, right where your knife will stop. And then you go here, you cut around that green membrane. You can see this, you don't want any of that. That's not very good. It's very bitter, it's not good. So then you cut around, keep going around. And then at this end, so you don't cut your fingers, you go turn it this way. And just like that. Not much green on there, and you have perfect nice pieces for parties. And I'm gonna try it by here. Wow, this was a perfect candle, freaking delicious! Really, really good. Wow, that is juicy and good. 
Holy cow. Packed with flavor. So again, let me show you one more time. So you take it, slice here. You're gonna feel the knife kind of stop. It's fine. If you go all through, it's okay. Slice it down through. Make these a little bit smaller because they're gonna be wider pieces. Go down again. Go down again. Go down again. Now, if you want to be just a wee bit smaller, take your knife like this. As you can see, you just go down through the middle. Like that. See, now you got smaller pieces. You take your knife and go around it. Stop there at the last piece. Look at that. You have barely any waste there. It's right down to the bottom. Again, and you cut that off. And look at that, all you have left is the rind. I mean, that is as close as you're going to get to it. That's the best way I think of doing it. That's how I cut up my cantaloupe. I think that's the best way of doing it. So, if you guys like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Have a great day.